<laughs> you know, I've realized about myself, like, I've been working hard to kind of try to transcend my ego, you know? Like, I, been, I don't know why you just laughed right there. Like, I just like, like, oh, oh maybe because I'm like on stage demanding the attention from a room full of people, whatever, that's fine, that's fine. But, but I'll be honest with you, like, I'm way, I think at this point I'm probably like the best in the world at transcending my ego, <laughs> you know what I mean? You know? But, uh, but and you know what you know I know I'm kind of a monster? is like, I write publicly a lot like at a cafe and my mind I'm like well people need to see the process <laughs> people need to know what's going on right here it's like ha 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 look at me I am writing publicly oh this is going to be so funny look at me don't look at me look at me don't look at me what are you looking at look at me don't look at me it's kind of weird right <clears throat> so one time I'm writing publicly and I look over and this beautiful woman she's also writing all right, and we lock eyes, and it's like, okay, here we go. Time to feed the egos of each other. What are you working on? What are you working on? Right? But before I could tell her about my bullshit, she told me what she was doing, and I was disgusted. I was fucking, it was fucked, right? Okay, here's the thing, okay? So she's super hot, 26 years old, aspiring actress, and she just started writing her memoirs. Oh, gross. <laughs> Fuck you, lady. Fuck you. Can you imagine reading anything worse than a super hot 26 year old aspiring actress's memoirs? Are you kidding me? I'd rather read Mind Cop while episodes of two broke girls playing in the background. It's fucking ridiculous. Who does she think she is? And how do those memoirs go? In chapter one, I was born. Yay! Fucking yay! Chapter two, now I'm 13 years old and I already have perfect tits. Life's gonna be so sweet for me. Wow, John, that's a creepy thing to type even in character. <laughs> Chapter three, I just graduated high school where I was voted most likely to be famous, which instilled in me a double-edged sword mind fuck. One edge being that I'll forever think I'm more talented than I really am, and the other edge being that no matter what I achieve now that's not in the entertainment industry, it won't matter to me at all because high school told me I was supposed to be famous. <laughs> Chapter four, it's my first day in New York, just lost my anal much anymore. Whoops. <laughs> Chapter five. <laughs> Chapter six. <laughs> Chapter seven. God damn it. I was supposed to book that fancy feast commercial. Fuck you, cat. <laughs> <laughs> Chapter eight, now I'm a pregnant interior designer. The end, the end, this is the end. My only friend, the end, this is the end. My only friend, the end. Father, I want to kill you. Mother, I want to, ow! Five to one, baby. One in five, no one here gets out alive now. They got the guns, but we got the numbers. Gonna win, yeah, well, taking over. Come on, John, no one knows what the fuck you're talking about right now. It was a Doors reference, man, you're cool. <laughs> Do you guys know that if you Google Big Bang Theory, the first seven entries are about the shitty television show. <laughs> and the eighth entry is about the generally accepted theory of the creation of the universe. <laughs> if that is not a fucking sign of the times you fucking live in, I don't know what it Weeks after my grandfather died, 